and welcome back to another video with Jess. Today's video, quite a chill video, but we are getting into the, the festive feelings. So this is like what I'm asking for for Christmas or like ideas for Christmas. I've actually made a little list here and I have a range of things from a low price to like a medium price to a high price. I'm going to try and add some examples like that I'll put up here and link some things down below. First thing we have is the Kiko and Maybelline lip glosses. These are the ones that I have. This one is a dupe for the Fenty lip gloss and this is the Maybelline Lifter gloss. They are $8.99 I think at Superdrug. And then this is the Kiko 3D Hydra lip gloss and this is a shade 17. And this is honestly my favourite lip gloss in the whole entire world. I'm really sorry if you can hear this chair squeaking. It annoys the life out of me. Yeah, lip glosses is the first thing specifically I would advise those ones because they're my favourite. Favorite. Next thing we have on the list, now this can range, I thought this could be a low price item or medium like moving up to the high price so this is some gold jewelry obviously if you don't wear gold jewelry silver jewelry low price like Primark has good jewelry but it does tarnish very quickly there's also a place well i think it's called like lariso or something they do do nice jewelry but again it does tarnish quite quickly so then i was personally going to ask for something like a bit more middle market like 20 pounds a ring and i found a place on instagram called oh, i don't know how to pronounce it i will try and insert something from there but i think it's called e a Avery jewel or like every jewelry there is a lot of places that do jewel kind of like them but it's a bit funky and it has like pops of colors in them similarly actually cheaper there was actually some really nice rings in mango and then obviously gold jewelry if you were looking for like a main present that you you can't decide what you want you want something special you could even ask for like a gold ring or like a, a gold necklace so it wouldn't tarnish but obviously that is a much higher end and after that we're going to move on to perfume which again i think has a, you can have a similar range with sorry i just got really embarrassed because i just remember i'm talking to myself in my uni room and everyone can hear me outside but that's fine so perfume again look you can start at the lower end loads of shops do dupes now body care has quite good dupes this is the black opium dupe in body care this is called black addiction and this is the la via bell body care dupe and this is called la vie de scan scanner bella sorry messed that up a bit there the sore sprays are really nice there was a spray that i got in my what i got for my birthday video i'll see if i can find it that one smells really nice that's one of the super drug own sprays and then moving up you can go more high market so when i went to lanzarote i actually got olympia in duty free because i thought i'd treat myself i've never had my own high-end perfume i've only ever used dupes but i've always thought that it's a really good thing to ask for as a christmas present because when you buy it for yourself sometimes it feels a bit unnecessary but as a gift you really appreciate it and obviously you'll you'll definitely get use out of it my personal favorites in perfumes if you're looking for something to ask for i like olympia giorgio armani c black opium i also like lavia bell so if you're looking for a perfume to ask for i would highly recommend them i feel like they're quite easy to like next thing on my list is card games and drinking games because i'm currently a uni student and praise you're always in need of a drinking game card game they come in handy so much so this is the game i have this is called new phone who this is a really good icebreaker actually so basically someone picks a card and then everyone else has to put down the funniest most relatable card and the first card is like a text message you have to put the funniest response and the other game i actually have and i would highly recommend both of these this game is the girls bathroom card so this is actually sophia and chintzia's game if you've ever watched them they're youtubers this is specifically a drinking game that other one this could be a family game although i think there are quite a few inappropriate cards and this one is specifically a drinking game so if you're looking to get drunk with your friends very good the girls bathroom also have smaller card packs next thing is kind of an a overarching category of room decor so i actually have sent this to my boyfriend of what i would like and it's a tiktok page and they do prints cushions and rugs with all sorts and if you've just moved into uni you want to make your room nice this is a great time to up your room decor if you ask for things like this there is loads of places on TikTok, loads of small businesses that you can get these things from. And that also makes a really lovely gift, like it's something nice to open. And then along with that category, fairy lights. I obviously took up fairy lights. You can easily get them from Primark. They're a nice, cheap 
present but really like a nice thing to open i always get excited when i buy my own fairy lights because i'm just excited to put them up so i feel like that's nice when you gifted them and then candles because you can't go wrong with a candle i i'm never gonna say no to a candle even though i'm not supposed to light them in my uni room as an alternative if you are at uni you can have a diffuser which obviously you don't have to burn and still makes your room smell lovely so also a good idea another low price thing christmas pajamas can't go wrong there i think i like everyone asks for christmas pajamas every year a hottie which i don't know if this is the correct name for it but it's basically like it's like a hot water bottle but has beans inside so you put it in the microwave and it warms up and it's like a teddy and my uni room i think i actually might have figured out the heating now my uni room used to be freezing so that is quite high on my list of hottie <laughs> then the last thing slippers for the lower price again you live in a uni accommodation sorry i feel like i keep references back to uni but I used to always ask for slippers every year at home because I wear slippers. I'm a slipper person. I wear slippers all the time, especially at uni. I wear them all around my accommodation. Next thing, I've actually asked for one of these and it's a sunset lamp which is like the new strip lights that are in. There's definitely somewhere on TikTok that sells them as a brand that I've seen laws on TikTok. I saw it laws over Black Friday. And you can get ones that are just one setting, just for the one colour, or you can get the one which is remote controlled, which has loads of different colours, or you can get the one which is app controlled, which has even more colours. Then I have a bra set for all you girls out there. I just think that's a lovely present. I think I asked for two last year. I might have even bought one for myself. You just also have to make sure people know your size, specifically with bras like a bit of a problem if someone doesn't know your size for a partner i think a bra set is nice to ask for also off your mum or whatever places like lounge do nice ones and boo avenue boo avenue really nice bra set it's obviously victoria secret and then next thing this one's kind of a one-off this is something i specifically came up with as a personal need for myself but a bag like a general good bag like a solid bag i have used this bag for the last three years like i got this in year 12 this is from top shop actually it's still in one piece and it's still doing well but it's just not in the best condition anymore so i have asked for a new bag for uni i actually did get this bag i ordered this bag off vintage expecting it to be a lot bigger like a similar size to the other one turns out it's actually rather small and it's not going to fit anything i need in it obviously topshop's still on asos but that bag is from topshop it was a really good bag so i would recommend looking on topshop for a bag or asos in general good bags so this is my last few things in the middle range i put essential oil i don't know what it is about them i just feel like if you're into your crystals your energy essential oils kind of have the same vibe lavender's good to help you sleep and i really struggled to sleep recently i just find it hard to sleep at uni so i think some essential oils could help with that like some of them that say like motivation and stuff which is obviously all good if you're doing college work a levels if you're at uni even gcse's all the way up i think they're a nice present to receive i would have appreciated them for the last few years tk max is actually really good for like gift sets of essential oils i've seen them quite a few years at christmas so i would recommend looking in there and then i've put skincare now this is a bit of an issue for me if you have a specific product in mind obviously great ask for that but i don't actually know any good products i'm basically use Lidl's face scrub and simple's moisturizer it kind of works for my skin i don't have the best skin in the world but i also don't have the worst skin in the world so i would like some products even to get rid of spots just like even out my skin tone but i don't know specifically any products i couldn't recommend any i know the liz earl skincare is quite good and my sister's asked for that as christmas present before maybe try out that if you're looking for some skincare i've tried some of revolution skincare before they did a lot of like high hyaluronic acid like all the droppy bottles they came out a few years ago i've never heard much about them but that's obviously a lower price range and if you actually have any skincare products you swear by you actually recommend please comment them down below because i need some and i would like to ask for some but i don't even know what to ask for now we're moving on to the most expensive things i think i only have three things left so the first thing that's your hint this is my uni chair it is a bit disgusting it's this lovely blue color actually at least mine's cushioned some people's aren't even cushioned some people's aren't wheelie so i'm not going to complain about it too much but if you don't have the nicest uni chair obviously you have to sit and do work in your room quite a bit and i think it would be nice if you asked for a chair i thought that was quite a good idea you could get you can get some really nice chairs basically even just from ikea you could spend as much on it as you want obviously there's a wide range the next thing is so 
some Doc Martin boots. I've personally asked for Doc Martin style boots because Doc Martin boots are expensive. And I basically, I've had these ones. I got these boots two Christmases ago. I've worn them so much. I've got my use out of them. These are from Boohoo. And if I can find ones like these, I might just ask for some of these again. The only thing is now the um, sole has like cracked. You can't even see, but it does have some holes around these. So they're not even waterproof anymore. Not ideal for a winter boot, but yes a good present they never go out of style they go with everything like you, you will just get loads of wear out of them i promise you so if you're looking at the lower end boohoo has some nice ones because that's where i got those ones from asos again and then if you look at the higher end obviously a real doc martens personally i like the platform one the last thing i have asked for is a colorful tracksuit i would really love a pangea tracksuit because obviously they're sustainable and like good for the planet and they're really cozy but they're obviously really expensive like i think the hoodie's 130 and the joggers are 130 or something like that i personally i've asked for quite a few things so to ask for a pangea tracksuit on top of all that i think would be a bit cheeky of me so i've asked for a colorful tracksuit as an alternative i actually i'm yet to find one i feel like boohoo has quite a few Primark's even had a few colorful tracksuits in they just have different so, like slogans on them that i'm not too sure about boohoo i have a nice pink hoodie from so i reckon they will do a nice matching set pull and bear is really good for hoodies i've got a pull and bear hoodie and i'm pretty sure they've got matching sets as well that is everything i'm asking for for christmas i probably won't ask for all of that because my mum might give me a bit of a slap and be like just what do you think i made money i just thought that was a nice broad range of ideas and i hope i've inspired you on some things for your christmas list i hope i've got you excited for christmas in the very least hope you enjoyed the video if you did please like and subscribe and i hope to see you very soon thank you for watching goodbye